Today we're going to be talking about wood ash. So all people that burn wood to keep warm have plenty of it. And inside wood are the trace minerals needed for good plant health. And that's also in the wood ash. So it says that you're supposed to use 5 gallons per, per thousand square feet of gardens or food pots to raise the pH to get a better food pot. So that's what we're going to do here. We've been doing this for, we've been doing it for years. So uh, this is something we're going to share today. So uh, this is the new food pot. It's brand new. And for some reason, you know, whatever. We got, we got great weather going on this year. As far as December 16th in Wisconsin. No snow, very little. And uh, it's 40, it was 43 yesterday. Got it probably close to 40 today. It's muddy out here, but um, I'm going to have a lot of wood ash, and I might as well empty my buckets now and get them all out here to get a start on them since it's, uh, since it's wet enough, and it's going to, you know, it should soak in. Never really done it this time of year. Usually I do it in spring, but either way, I'm going to get it all out here. Then I'm going to put it out in the spring also. Then I'll disc it and everything else, and then it'll get all over the place. So uh, this is where we're going to start. So as far as right here, right now, I'm putting it at the top of the hill, you know, thinking it'll um, probably go down eventually, you know, in the spring, once it snows and everything. But either way, like I said, this will get harrow dragged and disked and everything, and it'll really spread that out more. So wood ash, it's a, it, it sure it helps a lot. You, um, take less lime, but, you know, still lime, and still do a, so, a soil sample, soil test, see what you need. But uh, we've been doing this for quite a while, and it sure has improved our plots. And, uh, you know, it's free, so we put it out there. So I do usually put the uh, wood ash out in the spring. But like I said, it's nice. There's actually a lot of things we'll maybe we'll get done, hopefully, this year. I mean, the weather could change at any point. But, uh, you know, do what you can do. I, like I said, I'm going to do it. I'm going to make it. There's a trail I want to make back there. I just got to clear some stuff off, and I might get that done this year. So but usually I put the wood that wood ash out in the spring. Like I said, since it's warm, but save it up all winter, get it out. Like I said, it's five gallons for every thousand square feet. You don't want to overdo it, but uh, just you know, to get it out there and see what happens to your food plants. 